<laughs> oh, that boy's crazy. What's so funny? <laughs> Jah, hey. His schedule makes. Funny. This boy's funny. Well, I have something else funny. Is this your towel? No, oh, well, I have a pink towel. That's yours. See, that's the funny part. <sighs> Can you throw this towel for me? Sure. How hey. does it feel to you? A little damp. Wet. The towel is wet, correct? Yes. It seems to have been wet at some point. <clears throat> so what's funny is that this is not my towel. And you just told me it's also not your towel. No, it's not. So whose towel is it? Where did you find the towel? Another funny thing. I found it in the laundry room. Where the dirty clothes go? It was not where the dirty clothes go. Okay. It was laying on top of the dryer as opposed to leaving it in the bathroom where it would typically be if it was a wet towel, correct? <laughs> so now, I'm gonna ask you again, whose towel is this? I don't wash clothes. I'm, I'm never in the laundry room. So how would I know who clothes they are? That's a good point, because that's my point. I wash the clothes, okay. and I know that I washed all the towels over the weekend. How did the towel get wet is my question. Do you, do you just want to break up? Because I feel like you just like started stuff with me. I don't I, feel respected when you keep telling me you don't know what's happening. It seems, seems dishonest. So let me ask you this question. What's some possible scenarios that you think possibly could have happened? Because I don't know. So since you have no idea and nobody was here is what you said, correct? Nobody I knew because I was downstairs. So you keep defaulting to no one you knew as though someone has broken into our house. Because if that's the case, I need to call ADT. I don't know, are you insinuating that I'm cheating? Because if that's the case, why would I do it here? Why would I do it in my own bed and leave stains? Then why would I use a towel and leave it on the washing machine? So I just want to be very clear. What? What kind of- I'm not the one who said cheating. So this is something you're bringing up now. So you said you were cheating? I didn't say nothing about me was cheating. I'm just saying that's the only thing- You said you if I was cheating, why would I do it here? The way you're interrogating me about a towel that I don't know about, it's clearly that you think something more. I feel like what you're insinuating is that there's a ghost in the house. Again, so Casper now has went in the linen closet and got himself a towel, wet it, strang it out, and then threw it on the dryer. That's your insinuation, correct? Am I making you sleepy? Are you tired of this conversation? Respectfully, I am, because I've been working all day. I just came home from work too, and this is what I had to come home to. People hiding towels in the laundry room. How was it hiding though? It was because it wasn't where it was supposed to be. The wet towels hang like so, or like so, or like so. They hang and they dry, and then they go to the laundry room. Mildew, you don't put wet towels just down with the clothes. Do you want me to make up a lie? Because I don't know that none of that happened. I'm young enough to <laughs> to have my memory still, thank God, right? You I want to bring God into it. So let me ask you a question. Okay. I'm done. I don't want to talk about No, no, no. Just let me ask you a quick question. Be real quick. So if you had left home, maybe you went on a trip, you came back, and the TV was missing off the wall. And you said, babe, babe, what happened to the TV? And I said to you, oh, I don't know. So, so you, you've been here this whole time by yourself and you don't know what happened to the TV. That's what you would say, correct or no? Am I wrong? Are you, do you really think a towel being on a washing machine in the house is the same as a big old TV missing from It's the, house? the principle of the fact. Whoever is home knows what has happened, is my point. Just like the glass that breaks in the kitchen. Oh, I heard it. I was here. I know what happened. I know you don't think you're going to. You get up? Can you look at me? The What's the we're problem? Talking, we're talking right now. Can I have your attention? Okay, I didn't know we were talking. What's going on? Like, you gotta answer. I didn't know we were talking. I'm but saying I didn't know. <laughs> the point is. How does it feel to you? A little damp. A little damp. And another <laughs> word for damp would be. Moist. Wet. The towel is wet, correct? I didn't know this was. <laughs> <laughs> a, a, a multiple choice quiz. If something's out of place or not where it should be, or 
a damn towel was left on the washing machine. A damn towel? You cussing at me now? I didn't say, I said damp. D-A-M-P. Uh, <laughs> okay. Because it's not like you said damn, like a damn towel. Was, so I'm trying to understand. Go ahead. And then go in the laundry room and see if you see any other wet towels just hanging out in the laundry room. Okay? And then see, walk around the house and see if you see Casper in one of the other beds in the house. With oils and lotions and stuff you said he must have had. And when you find Casper, tell him he got to go. What up, world? It's Comedian Beer Bird. Thank you so much for watching my video. I appreciate it. Please like, subscribe, comment. Please hit the notification button so you can know every time I'm posting. If you're on YouTube, if it's on Facebook, please like and share. And keep coming to my page, man. Every Wednesday and Saturday, I post sketches. And Monday, I do my motivation on Monday. So when you need that motivation, man, come holler at me. I'm here to encourage you, man, so we can all get to our dreams and see them come true. If y'all don't know, my whole slogan, man, what I'm about is believing, man. Believing in your dreams, believing in these things that you want for yourself. Only believe, man. I have a clothing line out. If you would love to buy a shirt, I got hoodies, I got joggers, I got workout stuff for the ladies and the fellas. Go check out onlybelieveapparel.com. In the description below, you can see the handle, or it should show up somewhere here, wherever it shows up. But only believe apparel where you can see the clothing line, man. It's all about believing, man. Chasing your dreams, man. Thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. Barry Brewer here, man. Peace out. See you soon. Peace.